UN denounced Russian annexation, while West backs Ukraine with more air defenses. The United Nations General Assembly overwhelming condemned Russia's attempt annexation of four Ukrainian areas while Kyiv allies committed more military aids after intense Russian missile strike. In New York, three-quarter of the 193-member General Assembly, 143 countries voted on Wednesday in favor of a resolution that called Moscow move illegal, deepening Russia's international isolation. Only four countries joined Russia in voting against the resolution – Syria, Nicaragua, North Korea and Belarus. 35 countries abstained from the vote, including Russia's strategic partner China, while the rest did not vote. Ukrainian President Vladimir Zelensky said on Twitter he was grateful to 143 states that supported his strike. Attempt at annexation is worthless. Pledge from allies include an announcement by France that it would deliver rather an air defense system to Ukraine in the coming weeks. Canada said it would provide artillery, around with winter clothing among other supply. At the meeting of the Ukraine Defense Contact Group in Brussels, U.S. Defense Secretary Lloyd Austin said Russia's latest attack laid bare its malice and cruelty. Since invading Ukraine on February 24, at least 26 people have been killed since Monday in Russian missile attack across Ukraine. Ukraine has shifted momentum since September with extraordinary gains, but would need more help, he said. We are going to do everything we can to make sure that they have what's required to be effective, Austin told the reporter. Zelensky say aid will hasten war's end. Zelensky said the increased aid will strengthen the counteroffensive. The more assistance Ukraines get now, we sooner will come to an end of the Russian war," Zelensky said by video to a forum during International Monetary Fund and World Bank annual meeting in Washington. Moscow in September proclaimed its annexation of four partially occupied regions in Ukraine, Donetsk, Lukansk, Kherson, and Zaporizhia, after staging what is called referendum. Ukraine and allies have denounced the vote as illegal and coercive. The General Assembly vote follow a veto by Russia last month of a similar resolution in the 15-member Security Council. Russia's UN Ambassador Vasily Nebanziev told the General Assembly ahead of the vote that the resolution was politicized and open provocative adding that it could destroy any and all effort in favor of diplomatic resolution to the crisis. The move at the United Nations mirror what happened in 2014 after Russia annexed Ukraine Crimea. The General Assembly then adopted a resolution declaring the referendum invalid with 100 voters in favor, 11 against and 58 formal abstentions. The United States and other Western countries lobbied ahead of Wednesday vote. They won dozen more votes than compare with the 2014 results, and improved on the 141 countries who voted to denounce Russia and demanded withdraw its troops from Ukraine within a week of its invasion. That's all for today. Thank you and goodbye.